Flames and smoke can be seen billowing from a school bus. It was a frightening experience for students and a bus driver when the bus they were in caught on fire in Charlotte-Mecklenburg County earlier this month. Luckily, the school bus driver helped the six students escape. Kids were good as well because they were calm as well. And that would kind of like help with me staying calm because they was calm as well. So they were little heroes as well. Preliminary inspections pinpoint what caused the problem. The problem lies between this water valve and the firewall. The wires rubbed against the valve. In the tight area. Wearing the wire covering off and sparking the fire. Now inspectors across the state like Bob Houston with Durham Public Schools are examining school buses for similar wiring issues. Check every wire and, and cure the problem. And when it's done, they say it's done. I got confidence in them. I know the bus is safe. Bus models shipped to schools across the state between 1998 and 1999 could be in the same situation and are all being checked out. It obviously has taken some time for the 98, 99 model buses to have this problem, uh, but we'll actually add it to our inspection process so our mechanics are looking for that every time they do an inspection on the bus. The newer model of buses don't have that same problem because the valve and wires are placed further apart. However, they're still being inspected anyways just to be on the safe side. You see how far out this valve is compared to the 98 models. This is a precautionary thing that we're doing to make sure that, that the buses are safe. Making sure each time a student steps on a bus, it's a safe trip. In Durham, Julie Fertig, News 14, Carolina.